Okay. But yeah. No, I'm, I'm actually liking that. That, that was a very uh, great way to end everything. <laughs> um, no, that was that was nice. One of the uh, the moves that I was going to get Jet to do if he succeeded in a limb grapple was just uh, pick Dante up over his head and just slam him into the ground. If that was the case, it would just have been like a goddamn somersault from hell of each other just throwing each other into the ground yeah. until they made their way out of the castle. But, um... <laughs> uh, I, I think the, the best way to explain it is um, if... Like, the scene from when the Hulk grabs uh, Loki and just, like, beats him on the ground. <laughs> oh, you're my god! <laughs> Puny god. <laughs> god I miss playing as Jet. <laughs> that felt good. And I love being sorry so much. I love this character. You love sorry? Yeah. Yeah. I love her as a character. She's fun. I ain't gonna lie. She is very fun. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I also found it very appropriate that uh, Sari and Jet just get each other. <laughs> yeah. The, uh, that's great. It's just that mutual, it's that mutual respect between barbarians. It's like... Yeah. Jet gets Dante, who gets sorry, who gets Jet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's great. <laughs> Hello, Boomer. <laughs> okay. okay, you go do that, Boomer. Boomer has found something. Boomer's gonna kill something. Oh my god. It, it was funny, we were talking to the AT&T people today because, again, we finally got a new service out here Yep. that hopefully will have better internet than we have now. Yeah. And they're like, are there any special instructions that you have? And it's like, yes! I have a 90 pound murder machine on the premises, so please do call before you come so I can put him up. Yeah. <laughs> I, I have a 90 pound uh, cuddle machine that likes to murder. <laughs> <laughs> He's 90 pounds of cuddle or murder, depending on who you are. Yep. Well, it. it it's either cuddle or teeth cuddle. Yeah, he has found something. Sorry, Jet. <laughs> oh my god, yes. <laughs> You'll need to send that to me. Uh, what Sue sent earlier. Oh, okay. How lifters, How lifters gre greet each other, Shasari and Jet. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Did you get it, Boomer? Did you kill it? <laughs> I killed it so good. <laughs> They, just... <laughs> they don't speak, they just flex at one another. <laughs> 
a dual punch like that from those two would kill a man. <laughs> yeah. No. That like that would kill an immortal. Yeah. <laughs> I want this friendship so badly. <laughs> <laughs> I want it so bad. <laughs> oh no. Jet not we sure if can more. reproduce, but with this woman, maybe we'll try. <laughs> <laughs> That's oddly sweet and it upsets me. <laughs> <laughs> we need some Skype cutscenes on the ship. Yeah, we need to like. Oh, just everybody hanging out. Yeah. Yeah. Like, just have like a map of. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just. We're gonna need a map of Char Starry's ship, and then a map of like Yadis's ship, and then everybody intermingling, <laughs> and it'd be like good between episode shows. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh. Did you bark at it? Yeah, I did. Did it did die? Did you scare it away? From all the barking? I dover root it. You double root it? I dover root it. Dover root. I push a root it. Push root dog? That sounds Push root dog. Push root dog. Push root dog. Push root dog. Good. Good bro. Good bro. <laughs> bro. Good bro. Sa sa yeah, sound it out. Good job. You did it. You did it. Da, 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 da. Push, 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 push. I need to figure out what old tattoo she has. I know some of them, but no Yeah. Uh, we'll have a map or two to figure that out. Mm -hmm. Mother if, Earth if, is going through her cycle again. <laughs> if I get done with the maps at the rate that I hope I do, we'll be done with. We'll be able to do Kane's map tomorrow. Yay! If everybody, if everybody's available, and um, if I can get off my lazy ass and finish it. If we do it uh, the same time that we started today, then yes, I'll be able to do it because I still got tomorrow off. Uh, uh, the day after, though, I will be working, but the day after that, I have off. Yeah. Which is uh, goddamn weird, because we're going to be working that day, but yeah. but we'll have that night off, which is your morning? Yes. Yeah. Uh, so, the day, the day that you have off, we'll have that night off, so we'll have that next morning off. Yeah. For you. Yay. Uh, it's so annoying how it's like, oh yeah, Monday. Everyone still has got to go to work on Monday. Like, fucking, why doesn't everyone just take that day off? It's easier. Honestly, yeah. I am sitting here just, why am I coming back to work Monday? I'm not going to get anything done. Yeah. Because, like, at least with my work, I got to sit down... For every job, it takes me like a couple days usually. Yeah. Are we doing more DD stuff or not? Uh, if Sugs gets back, then yes. We have. I've been like... back. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. I said he was really tired. wants to hear the magic that I pulled. Yes. 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 Tell us. Tell us the magic okay. you pulled. Okay. I don't have. A uh, charging cable, but I do have an extender that attaches to an adapter that attaches to another adapter that attaches to one of those wide ones that plugs into a, a battery pack that has a built in plug for Android. That's beautiful. <laughs> I Sugi, I love you. <laughs> that is the most Jerry rigged shit I've ever heard. I love it. <laughs> I'm at twelve percent, and it's all I had. I have to go get a new one tomorrow. 
Clutch to the max! Fuck yeah! Yeah, man. MacGyver that shit. Had to. Yeah. Fucking get a bubble gum and a paper clip and shove that shit into a light socket. Hell yeah. Infinite energy. <laughs> right. Alright. 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 Uh, I don't have the next map made out because I'm a lazy asshole, so I'm gonna go this over this audibly. Okay. Giannis breaks out in a cold sweat from this weird ass dream he just had. He is aboard his ship. From the motions around him, he can tell that they've reached dock. It's no longer in the motion of moving, but looking towards the end of the bed, he can see a clearly awake alley who has had a similar dream. Oh my goodness, that was so trippy. She's just staring at him blankly. Uh, I mean, like, where do I even begin with that? Fucking Nero, what? Surprise! <laughs> At this point, they realize they had the same dream. Oh, crap. Something's happening again, isn't it? <laughs> yep. Uh, I really hate it when that wolf asshole is correct. Okay. Same. All right, well, uh, I guess we'll just have to play this one by ear, I guess. She reaches up and grabs the tips of her ears and holds them up pointedly. By ear? Like the girl from the dream. Yeah. She drops them when she realizes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah, that was... Actually, I didn't know what she was. I couldn't really make her out. Uh, from... Giannis can't remember a face. He can't remember details. All he remembers is red hair, extravagant clothing, and pointed ears and a fluffy tail. Well, there's only one person that could be. But wait, no, she has two tails. She just stares. <laughs> hmm. No, the... No. Though you want to relate the two figures, you realize that they're separated by millennia of history. Yeah. That's... That's actually quite interesting. I... Yeah, there's, there's got to be more connection than just the same color tail and ears before I can actually go, oh yeah, let's go to Julia and ask her questions about it. Allie just leans over and pokes him in the face. Yeah. Yeah. I know you want to think about her all the time. <laughs> she says sarcastically. Well, her and you and Maybe. She he puts says, her hand on his face and just pushes him back down into the <laughs> pillow. <laughs> she knows where he hides this fanfiction of her, Juliet, and Isabel at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> and no matter how many times I set it on fire, it still comes back. <laughs> he still makes it out of a joke. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a running joke between the two. A joke. Right. Anyway. I'm, I mean, yeah. <laughs> so it, it, gets, it gets you mad, and it's funny. Because you're cute when you you're know, mad. You know I could just leave you and go be with her, right? <laughs> yeah, please don't do that.
He hugs back. Uh, so we made it to port. Uh, God, I feel nope. a little stiff. He crawls back up under the blanket. Nope. <laughs> I'm not ready to deal with any of this. I mean. I mean, I knew about the green mama, but I don't know nothing about no red mama. Uh, okay. And my ears won't pop in from the sea level. <laughs> Uh, Yanis makes a history check. Is there any, uh, person that gets close to the description of the, the dream woman? Uh, history check for, uh, Giannis. Uh, I will go ahead and fully say I cop out here. Mm -hmm. Just seek Hero and subdue, supplant him with Romulus. Okay. Uh, the wolf mother. Oh, okay. Huh? Um, okay, I, I apologize. Let me re let me rephrase that. Uh, Giannis makes a history check. Uh, he knows very... No one really knows of the mythical fear, uh, figure that is Nero. Uh, other than, supposedly... Uh, he, other than for three things, supposedly, he built the Empire of Nero by himself. He invented uh, language and the written arts, and that he was raised by a wolf mother from the wilds. Hmm. Okay. That seems... Wolf Mother from the Wilds. He mumbles to himself and looks questioningly at Allie. She's un she's underneath the cover, just her head is poking out, but her butt's up in the air, <laughs> so you can see her tail like moving the cover back and forth. <laughs> Vicious killer. <laughs> Stares up at you. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so, but then again, like, wolf is not the same as a dog, though, so therefore it wouldn't be a Q-Seth. She squints her eyes and decks him in the stomach. <laughs> <laughs> Love you too, Ellie. Where do you think dogs come from, you dumb dumb? I mean, I'm trying to... You had... You had... No! She slashed it out of his hand. You just have various noisemakers at your side. I, I literally have a, a, a party blower. Like, I've had it for several years. You have a and accordion at, him, on him at all times. That, that is canonical, yes. Yep. I, I had a grandpa moment there. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. Like so you had the same thing I did, yeah. Where city was on fire. Yeah, it was completely destroyed. There was one kid who was rummaging through, like, the remnants of a library. There was a woman there. Red yeah, hair. red red hair, tail. She holds up her ears again, pointy ears. Yeah, that that part doesn't get me. It's like pointy ears, like pointy fox ears or pointy elf ears. Wolf ears. Wolf ears. Okay. Like, alley, but pointy. Yeah, not floppy. Okay. I uh, think, uh, you know, a shepherd dog versus a uh, Labrador or a St. Bernard. Yeah, I'm, I'm just thinking of Boomer in radar mode. Yep. Okay. Alright, well, uh, hmm. 
So we've essentially had the same dream. This is not the first time that this has happened. Usually yeah, when that they... happens, it's a prelude to something huge and painful. And being that it's us of all people, she crawls back up underneath the blanket. <laughs> Haven't we been through enough Mr. Fate world? <laughs> <sighs> All right, time to get my grenade launcher. <laughs> no, I'm really staying here now. <laughs> yeah, I'm... young stills in the grenade launcher is a wonderful idea, <laughs> <laughs> as he always does. <laughs> it is an idea. It is great. You will come around. <laughs> <laughs> Not if you keep going. You need just you, you just need to be convinced. Of how how awesomely powerful it is, how useful it is. Not when you're on the receiving end. Yeah, but imagine if like everyone else is on the receiving end. <laughs> it's never like that for me. <laughs> She's standing up on the bed underneath the blanket like a ghost sheet. Sugs is just eating like a pack of pocky, watching all of this happen. <laughs> Brand name. Pocky. I don't. Brand know. name pocky. <laughs> <laughs> no, she reaches into a pocky pack and pulls out a donut. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, goodness. <laughs> Just got a goddamn Dunkin' Donuts box. <laughs> Krispy Kreme, bitch. <laughs> uh, okay, how about you, Sugs? Are you getting any any of these dreams at all? Uh, I do sleep. <laughs> yeah, Sugs would have not had any of these dreams. It seems to be exclusive to Giannis and Allie. Okay. So, did you have, like, I don't a sleep. person perspective? Or, like, first person? Uh, Giannis and Allie both would have had first person perspectives of this particular yeah. dream. From their respective roles. Mm. 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 Oh, okay. Alright, um... So we've had a dream, it's the same one. Uh, and we're in Swadia right now. <sighs> by any chance... Hey, hmm? By any chance... Would you think a bard... Or perhaps, um... She frowns. Yanis defensively yeah. shrugs. I was talking about Jet. I was talking about Jet. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> she, she, starts, she starts grabbing her things. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Not even listening anymore. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. What what things are you even packing there? You only own three things. You're just grabbing random shit. <laughs> it's just like goddamn mortars and pestles. There's and... a there's a candle that's lit. She slides that in the bag. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, whatever. Uh -huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> bag is currently on. There fire. there is a fish tank in the corner, and she just starts grabbing fish out of it and throwing it into the bag. Is this like taking things in Skyrim? <laughs> yeah, it's like the, it's like the ex girlfriend taking your shit. She grabs the blanket and the pillow off the bed and walks out the front door, <laughs> out the tech door. Uh... Let's go see this bard that you want to see so bad. I mean, I, w I was going to suggest the bard, or perhaps Zaffy might know something because he's you know knowledgeable. Sure. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, give me this one, will you? <laughs> no. Yanis walks on a defeated man. <laughs> <laughs> Allie walks just slowly dropping things as she's walking, realizing, oh, I don't need this. Where did this come from? <laughs> I was going to give her a bonus to have random items for the 50 50 coin flip for the next mission because of that, but never mind. <laughs> she's keeping the pillow, why do you? Kleptomaniac with short term oh. memory loss. <laughs> It's like Sug's bag of holding, but instead of useful stuff, it's just whatever stuff. 
Oh, I have. The bag a was whatever stuff. I have I a, say, a gold, a living goldfish. Sticky's <laughs> <laughs> like, bag is both useful and random crap, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, but it's uh, useful random. I'm sure she's got some useless random crap in there. <laughs> Maybe. Just for the sake of having it. Boomer, boomer. Boomer. Do you need to potty? Why didn't you potty before? <laughs> I didn't have to go then. I have to go now. I had to bark at the stuff before I potty. God mm. damn it, dog. Uh, that's your honest right now. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yep. When, you, when your doggo is cute but being difficult. <laughs> Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Just the whole time they're walking. Yeah, uh-huh, I believe you. Uh, and it's just Yana's groaning, feeling his manhood just recede. I have something for that. I do not need what any... What did I miss? Uh, the whole time they're walking, Allie's just, uh-huh, 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 yeah, uh-huh, I believe you. Yeah, sure. And then... Fist full of unnamed blue pills. And you that Yon is receiving. Something for that. Uh, blue pills for the blue ball. No wait. Yeah, That's... nah. Okay, first of all, I am not taking medication from you. <laughs> that is a horrible idea. Come on, how bad could it be? <laughs> just, just, just take a couple. If, if your manhood lasts longer than four hours, seek a doctor. But I am the doctor in question. <laughs> so there's no risk. There's always a risk when it comes to that bag. And whatever you pull out of it. <sighs> <laughs> It fixes your pee pee. <laughs> pee pee up. Pee pee up. Pee pee up. <laughs> my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. Before they reached the palace, Allie would have stopped being a total bitch <laughs> and started walking beside you on it. Still with a smile on her face, mind you, but. Yeah, oh, this is yeah. the entire way. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm getting an idea. Uh, as soon as uh, Ali stops <laughs> acting the way she is, uh, <laughs> yeah, it just pats her on the head. Imagine this. Yep. A cast iron skillet with a rocket engine attached to it. Oh, goodness. But why? <laughs> um, why? Okay, okay. Her door. No, no, no. no. It, it, it's, um, it's like the rocket propelled sledgehammer. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Glory, it's sorry as Justice is to Dante. Oh my god, it is. <laughs> uh, a rocket propelled iron skillet. The wife's most lethal weapon. <laughs> Wouldn't there be a rolling pin? Yeah, I guess. It depends. It depends on what game you're playing. If you're playing Grip Ball, it'd be a skillet. If it's just, you know, an average game, <laughs> then it's a rolling pin. Poison coated rolling pin. Jesus. I mean, if if you were if you were in um, the the Far East, it wouldn't be a skillet. It would just be like a small knife, but you would have to use uh, sugi heels. I don't get it. The angry uh, Asian housewife just charges with a small knife, but instead of running, you use your sugi heels. Oh. oh, are you talking about oh. heels? Yeah, heelys. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. 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 I, I forgot. I forgot the name of the actual thing. I don't think I named them. Yeah, but they're, they, they're, they're called heelys. 
They're just Healy's TM. Uh, we got to avoid copyright, so uh, Heal zoomies. Wheelies. They're called zoomies. Okay. Zoogies. <laughs> Zoogies. Zoogies. Uh, Zoogies. Zoomies. Uh, Zoogies. Zoomies. Oh, well. Be right back. Oh, jeez. Okay. okay. All right. We've been through one map so far, so let's see if we can th get through two more. Is there one next... after this? Yes. Okay. Oh. Yay. I wouldn't have stalled for so long. I thought this was the only Yeah, I thought this was like the last map as well. I wouldn't have stalled for so long if I knew. If you really stretch it out, it could be four more maps, but... No. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm gonna be gr getting grumpy, and I don't want to get grumpy again. Yeah. Started grumpy, and then Jet had to speak. Yeah. Like, and then it was fine. I I'm sorry, but Jet's a lovable character. Everyone loves Jet. How fucking dare you? Everybody <laughs> loves Jet. Play the '90s theme music. <laughs> And it's just like a happy household, and then just Jet sitting there stoically at the dinner table. They're like friends, but you take out the main character and put it, shove Jet up in there. <laughs> well, that's like, uh, everybody loves Raymond, but, uh, it's just Jet. No one else, just Jet. <laughs> everybody is Jet. <laughs> I don't know, like, it's everybody loves Raymond, but Raymond has the anarchy symbol spray painted over it, and... <laughs> Just have Jet, like, standing in front of it. I've never seen an episode of Everybody Loves Raymond, but it's like Raymond is Jet, and then all of his friends are like, sorry, Dante. <laughs> yep. They're all looking stoically and fightingly at one another. I got it, I got it. Jet Jet's Bizarre Adventure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's... Holy it. shit. What would Jet's stand me. Uh, um, <laughs> JJ. Like, I, I, I kind of want to say that it's something to do with, um, like, an unmovable mountain or something like that, but, um, because he's, like, theoretically, he's very difficult to move. He's very Got resistant. It. Instead of rolling stones, it's stoic stones. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Beautiful. Like, uh, you got uh, Dante, Sari, Jet, and uh, Chrome a lot, just because why not? You gotta have one gentleman in the group. <laughs> oh my god, yes. Sari's um, sorry. <laughs> sorry would be Elstorm. We are here to drink your beer! <laughs> you gotta make it a pun, you can't rip it directly. Yeah. How's that? Uh, wait, is it? Elstorm? Melstorm. Like, like a Melstorm. Okay. Ciderstorm. Melstorm. Cider Tsunami. Sugi Y. What? Sugi Y. What, what did she say? Sugi, she didn't say anything. She didn't have to. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. I am Barbara Terry Town. Friends taking off and friends touching down. Is that what she said? She posted it. <sighs> oh, nightmare fuel! Hooray! Time to genocide the world! Yeah. Time to fix this problem. Just let the blue flood come again. Just don't do anything. It'll solve all of our problems. Just, just let it go for like four months longer than you let it go last time. <laughs> All you need to do is get rid of like 85% of the population and you'll be good. Yep. I mean, the dumb shits are going to die first anyway. Right. <laughs> okay. Um, let's continue on. I do like five finger pistols. Stones. Okay. Okay. I need this now in my life. So, the party after all of their banter, make their way to Safi's palace. Because A, Safi owes them a lot of favors. 
And they owe Safi a lot of favors. And they figure that, of course, um, this will be the best area to gather information. However, upon reaching the palace... Why are there so many pretty people? Uh, there are no pretty people. It's just guards. She's just staring at a guard. Why are there so many pretty people? Uh, it seems to be the remnants of a party everywhere. Uh, from the roll, I will say that Giannis definitely passes, Suits passes, Allie possibly passes, the, but the aforementioned party members notice a very noticeably Dante-shaped hole in the door. <laughs> How do you not notice that? Oh. oh. It's just person-shaped. But it was like flexing sideways as it went through. I can feel the justice radiating off of the edges of this. Thank you very much. It is now a blessed item. It does holy damage. <laughs> like there's only one person who could fit that outline. Only one. <laughs> there can be only room. Seppy, Seppy, Seppy. The swaddled man. Swaddle, swaddle, swaddle. Why is this place so freaking big? I mean, does Yanis does does Yanis uh, see like uh, a crater-sized hole? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, Yanis sees that. Yanis sees Yanis, Ali, and Sugs all see the aftermath of a huge ass party. Whatever happened here was fucking serious. We missed it, guys. We can leave now. Oh, jeez. I was not invited. Oh Damn, my god, this is a long-ass corridor. <laughs> Daffy, why? Uh... Shut up! Zoomies. <laughs> <laughs> and she whizzes by. <laughs> oh, oh no, she's gonna hit the carpet. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> hits the carpet and stumbles forward. Hang on. She rolls a twenty. They they sprout. Uh, uh nineteen. And they become a hoverboard. <laughs> uh, she rolls forward in a full tumble, and then comes springing back to her feet in a badass pose, like one hand on the ground, sort of, kind of doing the splits. Allie and, runs up and slaps John as superhero landing. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's honestly pretty badass. Uh, uh, Giannis notices to his left an ashtray with a burnt piece of paper in it. Uh, again, does Giannis see anything from it? Uh, not really. Uh, it's just a burnt piece of paper. Okay. Does, does it look like it was a scroll, or was it like a notepad, or was it um, like a, a banner? Like... Uh, closer to, say, like a post note or a letter. Okay. Um, like a, just like a single leaf of paper. Oh! A leaf, you say? Yes, a leaf. Oh! Okay. Why are these pillows bigger than mine? Uh, <sighs> smell o vision Uh, Yanis tips his head a little bit towards uh, Valindra in greeting. Uh, Valindra looks almost disappointed in whatever the hell happened the night before. She tips her head in, you know, respect, but also an embarrassment of the mess that surrounds her. Taking a step aside, she steps aside as you see Safael looking very hungover with a pillow on each side of his head, just laying down in this giant-ass bed. Hey, Safi! Oh, How my are God. you? Oh, why are you so high pitched? Because I told I was cute. That's not an untruth. 
Oh, no. Are you dying? Yes. Why? Because apparently my kids can drink me under the table. That's what you get for being old, I think. Yes, it is. <laughs> At least she always complains about it a lot. Oh. I mean, I'm not that old. I mean, how many kids do you have, Giannis? One. Alex. He, he looks what? at Allie. <laughs> they just lock up. <laughs> Wait, did I did I hear one? <laughs> yep. <laughs> he just looks what? at Allie. The fuck is that supposed to mean? She pulled out a knife. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's cute. <laughs> I will cut you. <laughs> Who's the whore? Um, Yanis huh? limply points towards Zaffy. But I mean... <laughs> I mean... Maybe? I'm just gonna go over here. Yeah. <sighs> hey, Zaffy. <laughs> I think he's too well over to answer. Uh, probably, yeah. I mean, I could fix that for a fee. Uh, dog of the hair, a raw egg, Worcestershire sauce, and some vodka. Yeah. And any form Red of eye? hard meat that you can get. Uh, was that a prairie oyster, or was that red eye? I forget. Okay, who asked me a question? All of us did. Okay, repeat your questions. I'm listening no. now. No. I forgot Red what eye. I was Prairie oyster. <laughs> he Red says eye. finger gunning at uh Sugs. Have you had any salt? Um uh, peanuts last night? Consume more salt. I know how to help. I offer a handful of blue pills. <laughs> Covered in plot salt. This will cure anything. Yana, says, takes, Yana says nothing. <laughs> Safi takes a handful of blue pills and eyes them knowingly. He pockets them. <laughs> <laughs> I might be able to use these later, but... Oh, that's disgusting. <laughs> Says Allie. One break up your Look, sometimes a man needs to go 40 rounds. I mean... No. What? <laughs> oh, goddamn, just disappoint your women, then. <laughs> Allie looks at you. <laughs> What? Yannis' manhood just shrivels up again. <laughs> I have something for that. No! <laughs> so he just has a sense of when manhood shrivels. Uh, at this point, I'm just throwing a bunch of them around. <laughs> you get blue pills, and you get blue pills. Like, just... <laughs> this one just throws a handful of them. Um... Allie sneaks three off the floor and pockets them. <laughs> Okay. Uh, Safi, do you know anything? Do you know? Do you happen to know anything about the founding of Nero? I hate to say, but I was across the world at the time. Okay, but you've heard something about it, right? Uh, yes. I have heard a few things about it. Okay. Uh... 
Would you care to enlighten me as to what you have heard about it? I was in the east at the time. He shuffles forward slightly, cracking his back and his neck. Uh, there was always a small, notable city on that side. I honestly could not tell you its name. But... Uh, there was a man, Nero. Namesake. Mm -hmm. Who brought that city to be a kingdom. From the legends, he leans a bit more forward, reaching around, finding a goblet of water and pulling it up to sip on, vainly hoping it's going to help with this hangover. I'm sure you've heard the legends. It was a few centuries before I met the man, but... I mean, yeah, I know about the legends, but, um... As far as the origin goes, uh, that's pretty much what I know. Hmm. He, uh... He didn't invent literature, I can tell you that much, but... Yeah, seems like an odd thing to claim. Uh, it's just that humans have a short memory. What about the dog woman? Uh, the wolf mother from Legend. Apparently she led him through battle. Uh, something else I can tell you about Nero. He also, uh, stand... Mate, well, he... Essentially designed their standard. Standard of custom? Uh, well, that too, but... Uh, their flag. Yeah. He, uh... Looks around, noticing that there's no Neronian flag in there. Because, of course, there wouldn't be. But... The, uh... Crimson flag with the silver eagle. Okay. Uh, not sure why the Neronians are so obsessed with eagles, but they put it on everything. Their coins, their gold, their currency, their parliament buildings. Uh, yeah, eagles are majestic creatures, apparently. I mean, I wouldn't know, I'm just a bird man. Uh, you don't seem like an eagle to me. Yeah, I'm more of an owl. Yeah. But, um... Okay. Slightly a bit off topic here, if you don't mind my changing things up. But, um... I was visited a couple of days ago. A couple of weeks ago, I should say. By, um... Two groups of people of interest... And I kind of would like to get your opinion on matters that are starting to unfold. I've been visited by the wolf pack from up north. Hmm. They seem to... Well, to, to sell it to you short, they seem to not like my inactivity to their standards uh, regarding Ali here. They see they see me as uh, achieving more than what I am doing. This leads me to believe that there is some form of um, a massive event on the rise. Not a day later, I was then visited by the Neronian Pope himself. Pope Victus. Sorry, Pope Victorious. Mm. I could never remember his name. 
He uh, apparently wants me to gather several people for a crusade. That is going to be happening. Oh, uh, really now? Yes. Suffice it to say... Alright, what is that? What was making that noise? Uh, that was Sugs putting her Crusader helmet on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um... Su suffice it to say, there is um, a lot of people asking these very strange things of us, and we're kind of hoping that uh, you, with your level head and all, <clears throat> would be able to help us clear things up. <sighs> well... Which would you like an answer on first? He rubs his hair, trying to brush it out of his face, but kind of failing in the process. He's making it messier as he tries to straighten himself. Pope Victorious is attempting to rise up a crusade against the North, although not everyone is on board with this crusade. Uh, I would like to know a little bit more about that, if I could. Uh, Pope Victorium, I believe his name is. Oh, right, yeah. I keep on getting that mixed up. Could never bother. I don't, I, I don't usually bother remembering their names. The only reason why this one interests me is because of his age. Yeah. He's rather young for a pope. He's uh, He's been wanting this crusade before he was, you know, Pope. It's just now that he's gotten the seat, he has the ability to call for a crusade. Hmm. Uh, as far as I know, within the church, not everyone is convinced to follow a young Pope to battle. Uh, no one's willing to follow a young general anywhere, to be completely honest. So, the church is not entirely convinced that this man, this boy, was appointed by God himself. I should say that the higher-ups in the church are convinced, but uh, it's not the higher-ups that fight, now is it? Yeah, that's a fair point. If you want men to die for you, then you need to actually prove yourself to them in some way or another. Hmm. Okay. I believe he's 18, 19 years of age. So... He's but a child. Uh, I might be able to answer my own question here, but his raid on the north is supposed to be something of uh, cleansing the world of pagans, I think. Or some such. <laughs> the church has never cared for the pagans, but... The church has specifically never cared for the wolf. <laughs> Or his ilk. Like, not gonna lie, I don't really care too much for the wolf and his ilk. Maybe one or two of them. Like, bear is okay. Ellie nods in agreement. But, um... So, what would your take on this be? My take? Yeah. Are you sure you really want my opinion on this? Well, you are Swadian. You are neither Galian nor uh, Neronian. You are literally the perfect person to get a non-biased opinion on. Swadian, man. 
Well, if you want my opinion, he stretches back, you hear his back pop a few times as he makes the motion, raising his arms. The wolf is very old for a human. Men aren't meant to live that long. It drives them mad. Dante seems to be fine. Uh, Dante's younger than he acts. That would explain why he sent his people to attack us at our house. Angry. Hmm. Uh, at that motion, uh, uh, angry fingernail would scratch at, uh, Safael's cup. Uh, though he would try and play it off, but that that really pissed him off. If I were you, and to be completely honest, I have no love for the church. But if a man was threatening my home, I'd burn his to the ground with him in it. Hmm. He raises a respectful finger to Allie. And then another enemy that I hated offered help. Then why not use them? Ah, uh, the enemy of my enemy. You can also burn your house. Yes. I mean, what's it to do? The more you throw at them, it just means you win. The more that perish, I suppose. So long as you're not throwing peasants at them. Mm. Okay. Uh, my next question would be... We are looking <clears throat> for a specific man. I believe uh, he's referred to as... The choir master. Yanis the looks choir. at it. the Yanis quickly looks at his notes to find what he was actually called. Uh, Radmar Kelton. Radmar Kelton. Yeah. Uh, Safi raises an eyebrow. I <clears throat> might know where the man is. Don't bullshit us, Safi. I'm tired. Tell us where he is. She's holding now, up now. one of his pillows threateningly. Now, now. I'm just going to ask for a favor for the information. And in fact, uh, I will give you the location of another individual. And this pillow. What? She's holding up one of his pillows. Uh, yes, you can have that pillow. Good. Would you like another? Yes. He motions to one of his guards to bring another pillow. Yeah. <laughs> I am the best negotiator ever. Yanis oh, gives what? a thumbs up to Ali. Doing a good job. Yes! Uh, <clears throat> one, one, one of the guards just ventures off to uh, go grab a pillow. But <clears throat> I'll give you the information of another individual if you simply agree to help me with a single task. What is it? What is the task? A task that's specifically and I mean specifically designed for you two. He looks to Giannis and to Sugs. It's okay, Pilla, we can be together. <laughs> Us two. Yes. And I'm not going to lie. If you're wanting to get this done, you're probably going to need Allie's help as well. Oh no. Hello, one day. <laughs> <laughs> so, what do you need me and Sugs for? I need <sighs> a flesh golem. No. A what? 
I'm not saying it needs to be alive, and I am definitely not saying to kill anyone for it. I just need a convincing cadaver. Why? That's my business. No. Yes. <laughs> no. She wipes the pillow. No. <laughs> Uh, in the Far East, necromancy is legal. You can go there and do your flesh golem business there, but here, no. I'm this... not asking. I am not asking for necromancy. I am asking for a convincing corpse. So but you need it to be to... animate. No, it does not need to be animate. It just needs to be. It needs to look enough. Like what? Like a person. Like who? Like, like who, <laughs> yeah. Anyone. Surely you can just pick up a person that has died recently from the morgue. I need them to be of a slim build and roughly six foot uh, seven. Six foot seven? Human? So, you? Allie points at him with the pillow. Uh, I'm not saying me. Uh, just uh -huh. a rough approximation. Mm. Are you gonna fake your death, Mr. Sassy? Ah, uh, that is my business. Uh, that's not little a little girl. No. That's not a no. <laughs> All you have to do is say yes, but I'm going to tell you, like. I mean, if you want me to issue you a death certificate, I can do that right now. He's a doctor. <laughs> uh, first off, your weight carries a little in SWAT, yeah? Oh, come on! Rude. <laughs> I I'm sorry to say, but most of your accomplishments have been in Gaul and Nero. I'm sorry, but saving the world seems like it should include the world, Mr. Seth. <laughs> Yes, but the world doesn't care if they don't speak the same language. But if blue people are eating your people, then, you know... I mean, holy shit sounds the same in all languages. <laughs> Actually, it's Kadafata over here, but... We get the meaning. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> Yana's just uh. pat Sugs on the head. Don't worry, I'll teach you one day. When you're older. <laughs> when you're older. Okay, so you need a fake body that looks like you. Okay. So you can fake your own death. Okay. <laughs> not saying I'm gonna fake my own death, but. Yeah, if you're not gonna say it, we'll say I'm it. I think I'm not. <laughs> Just give me a hunk of meat that's approximately my height. <laughs> <sighs> we have a volunteer. I'll need complete access to all dead bodies and your tallest tower. Well, first I'm going to give you a little push in the right direction. I'm not sure if it will help you or not, but uh, it's probably something else that you might want. A friend of yours. Hmm. Which one? Uh, a certain blue-haired loudmouth. Okay, you have my attention. Alec. Hmm. Okay, first and foremost... You are aware of his, uh, physical nature. Yes. His, uh, I'm pretty sure everyone is. His abnormalities. Anyone who knows him, knows him, yes. Yes. Talk to me yes. about abnorm. Now, I do not know if you know this about those of the vampiric persuasion. But, um... They sparkle. No, they don't sparkle, they just burn and die, but... Fire sparkling. Fire is sparkling, if you Soon throw Soon enough glitter, glitter into it. Sugi's fire is always sparkly. Well, Sugi doctors her fire, but... 
That, that's patented. So he's a doctor? <laughs> In a way. Right. I'm sure she has a PhD. And it's been something. Dick! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that just doubles over. <laughs> Where do you think these pills come from? Little <laughs> <laughs> well, Mitch. Uh, okay. Pills yes, we know we know about vampires and how they react. Well, do you know what happens whenever a vampire drinks the blood of something that uh isn't human? Uh, no. Like peanut allergies, right? I mean, well, I imagine. I imagine the ingestion would be exactly the same. It's just a lot of plasma infusion. Well, uh, first off, a vampire shouldn't be able to drink anything that isn't human blood if they're a human vampire. Um, so it doesn't Dante mean... can drink booze. Drink Dante can drink booze, but I think that's due to some sort of insane metabolism. Uh, but. If they drink the blood of something that isn't quite human, like it, milk? uh, like Sugi, like Sugi, like you. He looks to Allie. Oh, so something that isn't quite. <gasps> Allie, human. you're not human. <laughs> I'm not. Oh no. Uh. No, you're both. Oh. Yes. What? <laughs> Ali is a Q-Sif. Aww, how sweet. No, you. <laughs> I mean... You're it... a cutie. <laughs> Thank it, you. Uh, <laughs> it, if they drink something that isn't the blood of a human, it can be, um, well, a drug for them. Oh, I thought you were going to no. say they start getting uh, Down Syndrome. Oh, uh, no. But that would be very sad. <laughs> I imagine if they drink the blood of a whole person, it would be bad, yeah? Typically, um... Like a real holy okay. person, not like a fake Yeah, but, uh, that, that, that would actually harm them. Hmm. Well, it turns out that, uh, one of my daughters talked him into something last night. Oh. Okay. <laughs> So, usually, what mine and my blood does is uh, increases someone's libido. Okay, no. Now, 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 I would have believed that this man is a fucking eunuch if it wasn't for the pure amounts of testosterone <laughs> bleeding away from him. That's strange. Yes. He just flexed and screamed about finding the bad guys and delivering justice. And he made this hole in my door. That sounds like normal, Dante. Yeah, you're not really saying anything out of the ordinary here. You don't... He, at least he would try and use the doorknob before he would break the doorknob, but he would try and use it. <laughs> he flexed his way through the door. Yeah. As he is <laughs> one to do. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Point is, he went bandit hunting. So. Okay. Okay. You are forbidden from killing any citizen of Swadia for this task I've given you. That's a given. Well, it's not like we go around killing citizens. I know. I know. Okay. But there, here is someone you want and they have left a trail of destruction on their bandit hunt. So. Good luck. <laughs> Would you consider <laughs> bandits as Swadian citizens? Not if they attack first. Okay. So, recap. 
we are to find Dante? Uh, if you want to. It sounds like he's being normal, Dante. I mean, yeah, just... Alright, let's follow the path of destruction like a hurricane. <laughs> Goddamn force of nature! I mean, the orphanage bur burned down that one time, like... I did not burn that down! That was not my fault! I mean, he did blow out one entire side of the orphanage just by running at it. That was my fault. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Saki, we found Dante. Do we get paid now? <laughs> did you bring me a homunculus? Uh, it. Fine, I'll alchemy up a homunculus for you. It doesn't need to look like you, right? It just needs to be your height. Height and build. I plan on setting it on fire. Well, I won't judge your kinks, but let's get a move on then. <laughs> I thought I wasn't yawning over the last. Where's the tallest tower? I need lightning. <laughs> I'm gonna yeah. frag inside this bitch. It yeah, doesn't need works. to be animate. <laughs> I've succumbed to the lightning. Extra credit. <laughs> Extra credit. Uh, what, what is Ali saying? You guys have fun. I have succumbed to the lazy of the pillow. Oh, uh, no. Allie has, like... Oh, God, yeah. Allie is fully asleep, just gripping onto a pillow. Giannis has this pillow clipped to his belt, so he's just <laughs> dragging Allie along as he walks. <laughs> now she's on her back, like... I'm done for. <laughs> The pillow's big enough for her to lay on like that. Yeah, he's dragging the entire pillow. <laughs> yeah, I can, I can do that. It's a little sled for a sleepy room. Um, Alright, so the the next mission is... Yeah, recap, because I'm, I'm, I'm drawing a blank here of what we're supposed to be doing, other than making, like, a homunculus. Uh... Two tasks. You you need to make a homunculus. That is your only task. A bonus, because of statements in the last mission, mm -hmm. was you wanted to find Dante. Okay. Uh, he pointed you in the direction of where Dante went. And Dante went to a place where probably a lot of corpses were about to be made. Alright. Sounds like a, an ideal place to go. Now, the question... Day. Yeah. Um, now the question is, do you have a map for that? I have a map for that. It's just if everybody's up for it, because we went through literally one room twice, and it took four hours. I told you that we could spam it out. Yeah. As we are one to do. Um... <laughs> I mean, if anything, I mean I, I'm, I'm okay leaving it off here. Um, that way we can get like straight into the thick of the action uh, when we start up next time. Alright, you know what? I, I was worried that I wasn't going to be able to stretch this campaign out. I was worried it was going to be done. I telling you not to worry about I, I was worried it was going to be done in like six sit-downs and it was going to be terrible. No. But, okay, if just conversations led us this far, and we never had a single cop Well, we had combat, but it was player versus player, which is completely different. Yeah, but that was still fun. Oh, yeah, it's completely fun. I'm just looking forward to the banter in between Sorry and Jet. Yeah. Um, okay, so, Big. If you've, yes. learnt, if you've learnt anything from Ali's campaign... The very first campaign was nothing but talking. Oh, yeah. And it was enjoyable. Uh, I feel bad because... Okay, well, first off, the idea of the company making a flesh homunculus is fucking hilarious to me, so I'm <laughs> looking forward to that. Yep. Allie's scared because she's just gonna kind of be there. <laughs> Watching the horror. Really? 
the butcher that is Allie who skins trolls and leaves them hanging so her their friends will be terrified whenever yeah, they see their but... lovers just skinned and hung in the forest. Yeah, but I'm not trying to bring them back to life. Be weird. No one's bringing anything back to life. It doesn't to have to be animate. Oh, wait, hang no on a second. You say. <laughs> Oh, well, Sugi has the same generator that she has for the electromagnet. It's just two electrodes in the skull of a corpse. And she's just grinding away at it maniacally. Like, okay. Well, make life. So it doesn't have to look like Safi at all. It just has to be his height and it has to be his build. Uh, that being said... Wherever we are going to go for this body, we're going to need to bring it back here, so it might actually be an idea to animate it so it walks, so we don't have to drag it. Allie points at herself. I can turn into a giant dog, and he's just like... That's right, you can! How did I forget that? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> straight up, she straight up face palms herself. <laughs> <sighs> Okay, I, I know I say I'm old, but I'm not that old. I feel like I should retract that. I'm literally just a giant horse. Just... Why? <laughs> oh my god, why do I love you? Because <laughs> I'm awesome. <laughs> and uh, Allie isn't sure why, but she's pretty sure if she just whistles hard enough, Chunk will show up. Yeah. <laughs> Eventually. Eventually. <Yeah. laughs> He'll just slowly trudge through the entire ocean. No, I'm actually thinking he's like um, one of those, uh, I think they call them Jesus lizards, where they can run on top of water. Run on water? <laughs> Goddamn brontosaurus, just... <laughs> um, no, I like... could see that sound effect. <laughs> Just like in video games, you whistle and you turn around and he's there. Yeah. Well, you turn around well, just quick enough you can see him fall into <laughs> Like goddamn Diamond Dog Horse. Diamond, diamond. diamond Horse, what, whatever its name was. Yeah. Yeah. You would poof on top of a Jeep behind you. <laughs> just chunk of, chunk of bearing on top of a horse. Actually, um, <laughs> it's a lot like uh, Dr. Watson from Sherlock Holmes. They didn't uh, program in oh a walking animation. God, no. Yeah, that was nightmare fuel. <laughs> Except instead of Allie, Watson, it's just Chunk <laughs> with his dopey face. I don't think Allie knows the story. Allie doesn't know the story. Oh wow. Okay. So there's this old, um, there's this old video game of Sherlock Holmes, where you go through and it's a typical murder mystery. Uh, but it was so constrained with its, um, with its programming that they forgot to program in Watson's walking animation. So whenever you turn around, Watson will be right by your side. So what you can do is you can, as long as you maintain eye contact with him, he will not appear um, anywhere else. He'll always be where he is. So what you can do is you can look at him and walk like 50, 100 feet away, turn around and there he is right in your face. <laughs> so it's just 173. Yeah, but Watson. Yeah. No, it's the mannequin. Oh, 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 God. I don't remember what number SCP that is, but it's just a mannequin that just jump scares you. He just appears behind you. Wait a minute. In a Watson, one, seven, what, what, seven, three? Sound it out. Sound it out. Sound it out. <laughs> you can do it. You can do it. Oh. Oh. No, there was a reason I wanted that booty. What? 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 Who'll assemble me a corpse? I I I kind of want to actually. I I kind of want to ask a little bit about uh, what actually happened last night with Dante. Like, who did he get with? What happened there? Uh, you, you. Sorry, okay. I'm not. I'm not sorry. 
Sorry, not so Okay, nice. you you throw who he was hanging out with. Yep. And uh, just think about who would be like, maybe it would be pretty awesome if this dude drank from me. From me. Are we talking mouth or somewhere else? Blood. Blood. Oh. They drink from somewhere else. Dante drinks blood. Okay. Why do you have to it like that? Why you gotta make me sound gross? <laughs> I don't know what she's into. Pat, Pat. I mean, Allie's into tentacles. Shut up! Is Sorry in the tentacles, or is that just like a theme? I think I think that might be a theme because I know Juliet's also into tentacles. But I love you guys. <laughs> <laughs> God damn. Well, sorry has a reason. Well, sorry does have a reason for hers, but aside from my weirdness. Okay. Like at least sorry's the sailor. Yeah. yeah. Um, it's just face, Dad. God. Uh, wait, isn't that the opposite? You're a phase. I, I'm supposed to say it's a phase, not the kids, but it's a phase, Dad. That's not something kids say. It's a phase, Dad. God. Get over it. Uh, it, it God, learn how to have a dad. Come on. Wait, is Sari embarrassed to be a pirate? Is Sari embarrassed to be a pirate? No. Then, yeah, she wouldn't say it's a phase. No, she does that to confuse Safi. Oh, okay. Just a phase, Dad. God. Uh, if that is your real name, which uh. it is. But, yeah, I had fun uh, playing with Jet again. And once again, there are a couple of moments there where it's like, ah, oh, shit, Jet speaks in third person. I said I. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm God. starting to pick up mannerisms from other people. Yeah, I'm starting to pick up mannerisms from uh, Juliet. Are you okay? I think he found the tentacle monster. Oh my God, why are you so wet? Oh my God, no. Boomer, no That's no, horrible. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, sorry I didn't have much to contribute to this one, uh, Sugs. No, it's fine. I had fun. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh. Hi. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Get her, Boomer! <laughs> Kill her head! <laughs> fuck her up, Boomer! Fuck her up, Boomer! Oh, Boomer! <laughs> you, you sound much meaner than you Oh my than god. <laughs> <laughs> Which one is growling? Boomer. Oh, okay. uh, Boomer's growling. He actually like grabbed my hand there instead of the dog he was biting at. <laughs> that was softer than his play bites. <laughs> he's, such a, he's such a loud mouth he's with such so, a big He's such a baby. puss. <laughs> oh, I'm, so, I'm going to be so angry and loud and I'm going to bite you. Roar, and then he touches his teeth to you and then runs away. <laughs> now you gotta go outside. And that's why I call you my puss puss. Oh, no, you gotta be, be sweet. Be sweet. Oh, oh shit. Oh. <laughs> Just put her outside. Be a I'm man. Sorry. Come on. <laughs> it's just a puppy. God. But, <laughs> that's what happens when things grow up. But, <laughs> uh. Um, that, that, that was one thing that I picked up on uh, back when I was playing Jet. Like, while Big is out of the room, I'll, I'll say this because uh, as long as he's not here, I can get away with it. He own Zaffy only told uh, Juliet that she can't interfere, but said nothing to Jet. Sorry, I was thinking the same thing, and she <laughs> almost said something out loud, but she knew she should. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, I I play Jet as a, a not too intelligent character, but in that moment he knew to keep his mouth shut. 
Boomer. Uh uh, chill out. Boomer. You're sweet. He is sweet. He's a good push boss. Big uh, old pull it. But yeah. Fun session. I'm, tired. I'm gonna go die now. Okay. I had fun. It was the same this. room twice. I know, but I still had fun. Oh my god, okay. Too bad for you, we had fun, bitch. Fuck <laughs> it. <laughs> I had a whole fight scene planned. Yeah, Too but. Bad. I thought I was gonna plan an entire campaign after it. Because I didn't think it was gonna last that long. God damn, I'm out of practice. Yeah, but uh, at, at the same time, like, when you add player characters into your campaign, we will derail something. <laughs> Especially when you have people like us. Yep. <laughs> I love you, and I'm sorry for Subes, because Subes just was, took a background until Frankenstein came into the picture. And, you know, Blue Pills. Yeah. Which I've never... I've never... Okay, I've heard of a lot of people being red-pilled, but never have I heard people being blue-pilled. <laughs> and now that's a hilarious term to me. Just I'll, throwing Viagra at them. I can't wait for the pink pills to come out. Oh my... Well, that's gonna be like... <laughs> that's what I want to see, is the pink pills. I'll get right on it. <laughs> also, I need it noted that Allie has picked up three of the blue pills. Okay. Uh... That noted. <laughs> what, you, don't, you can't entertain your woman for 13 rounds? Allie just stares at you. <laughs> oh. I mean... We could try new science. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Giannis, this is a time for a man-to-man -man talk. How long can you last? <laughs> I'm leaving. <sighs> Who's talking to me? <laughs> Saffy. God. Oh goodness! Like, back up. Watch the foot. I will not deign that with uh, an answer. <laughs> I'm in danger. Your rounds. I will not deign that with an answer because I have absolutely no idea. <laughs> <laughs> At least he's honest. He's honest. Yeah. Uh, he's <laughs> honest. I want to oh! die! Shut up. <laughs> Love you too, Sugs. Oh. <laughs> Allie's literally gonna go kill herself. She, she's gonna go, like, t throw noose in the rafters. It's happening. If you, if you die, I'll kill you. <laughs> no, I'm gonna go commit swim poo <laughs> I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go toast the bath now. Ah, <laughs> uh, but I, I, t I tell My you what, D &D though. My campaign was so bad. Everybody decided to commit fucking suicide. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it is a thing. Like, uh, I love the entire blow dry the pool. I, I love the episode uh, that happened now, but um, my god, it felt like that I was like getting like ripped on a lot. <laughs> Like, both Jet and Yanis' manhood have been questioned so many times. <laughs> a, uh, I what? Hmm. <laughs> like, it, it's, Jet, it's funny. Like, with Jet, that was all dice. Yeah, I know. Uh, is, is that a love? I is know. that a love? Uh, with, Yanis was questioning a sex god, so... I know. Well, actually, it, it, even before that. Like, back on the boat. <laughs> when I was being oh, bullied. Oh, yeah, that, but that was all you two. That wasn't my fault. That was you two. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, I love you guys. Well, love you too, Allie. Part, Have a good the day. The next part is going to be a D1000 free fuck everything. Ah, oh, yes. Giannis gets to skull fuck everything episode, so. Yay! Let's derail everything. 
Allie gets to dog everywhere. Yay. I'm going to dog all over the place. It's going to be messy. Why do you sound disappointed? I don't know. I'm tired. I'm hurting and I'm tired. <laughs> I want to go to bed. Me too. Yeah. All right. Everybody go to bed. Everybody also, go to bed. my phone has been hovering on 2% for like 10 minutes now and I'm afraid. Well, I love you, Sugi. I hope you have fun. Sugs, love you. Mm. Go to sleep. Charge your phone. Yeah. Night. Yeah. Night. I have to get up in three hours. Oh, God. Oh, my God. What, what do you got to get up for? Uh, a lot of stuff. Too much stuff. Oh, jeez. Okay. Uh, Sorry for keeping you up so late. Love you, but go to sleep, baby. Yeah. Uh, all right. Night all. Love you all. Night. Love you too, Ash. I don't know if you hear Allie, but she's screaming, I love you, night, in the back. Night. I hear it. All right. See us. Okay. See us.